Oh, hi everybody out there in YouTube land. This is JP from MPMM Productions, host of Kayfabe Chronicles and all of that wonderful jazz. Um, so I'm coming to you guys um, just with a message in regards to just how everything's kind of going with me right now, the channel, all that sort of stuff. Um, so you guys don't know uh, a little bit about me. Uh, so my real name is Joel. I just go by JP just because uh, those are my initials. Uh, it just sounds a little bit sexier than saying my actual name. Um, so, the, those of you guys who don't know about me, uh, I used to be very heavily involved in the Winnipeg uh, theater, acting, film community. Uh, I'm an actor. Um, I'm also a writer, director, producer. I've done all that stuff. Did it for many, many years. Um, uh, then, of course, um, got married. Uh, we decided to have a child. Uh, he's, he's great. Uh, so right after uh, we uh, gave birth, uh, we, I decided that I needed to kind of stop focusing on the whole acting aspect and, you know, start to raise a family. Like, I was already working full-time jobs, like I said, like, acting wasn't my main gig. Uh, but I decided, you know, it, it just made sense to kind of put that on the back burner for a little bit in order to be a, a father. Um, so, uh, so just sitting there not doing anything creative wise it was just eating me up on the inside like it was completely just like driving me absolutely bonkers so I decided hey you know what uh, why don't I start a YouTube channel uh, you know give me something to do so I can kind of still stay creative uh, and all that you know I'm a fan of wrestling so you know I'll do, do it about wrestling why not you know I know quite a bit about it uh, there's a lot of good wrestling YouTube channels out there maybe we can get like a whole community thing going uh, so there you go so three years ago I, I started the channel. I put my very first review up, uh, uh, Takeover Brooklyn review. Uh, actually, no, that's a lie. My very first review video was um, was uh, me reviewing Suicide Squad. But let's not let's not talk about that video. Mm. Uh, but if you guys have even backtracked on the video, like so I actually had videos up way before. Like I did have a YouTube channel years before that where I would just actually post like my theater stuff. So you guys want to see some of my acting stuff? Uh, go back to like the furthest possible dates on this channel. Anyway, uh, onwards to uh, to that. So I decided to start a wrestling uh, YouTube channel. So I put out my first video. Obviously, didn't get a lot of views. Ain't no big, you know. I'm just starting out. I'll just you know keep keep better. And so I just you know kept posting videos. Like whenever something fun would happen, I would you know like post a review or a quip. Uh, didn't get a lot of views, but you know I understand. It makes a lot of sense. You know, like once again starting. Out, so I then decided to kind of change up the format where I'd actually possibly write some stuff. So uh, so I decided to put out my very first uh, long form video, the history of WrestleMania. Uh, so that said, that one took that one took a couple months to do. Like I said, I had to I watched all the WrestleManias, wrote a script, edited it, put music, videos, a lot of love went into that one. Um, it did okay. Like you know, got got a good amount of views, but still thinking, you know, what? hey, still. Still young, still still working out. Uh, but then, like I said, then the views weren't really getting there. Uh, the subscriptions really weren't getting there. So you know, I started to research a little bit more. I you know joined a bunch of groups, got a bunch of advice, and they're like, oh, you know, hey, you know, like if you really want to get noticed, you know, like join all these forums, sign up on Reddit, um, you know, post regularly scheduled things like consistency, keep posting videos. So I did all that. You know, I post three videos a week very active on social media I'm you know I have numerous Twitter accounts I'm a member of God knows how many YouTube video uh, groups and essentially and I and I've learned I've met a lot of great people in this community um, so yeah you know I kept doing that still really nothing um and and, and you know like and it was getting frustrating you little bit you know and I'm putting all this effort and love uh, into something that I believe believes doing good like you know I said I've, I've you know tried my best best here um I even you know kind of branched out to other stuff uh, so therefore I introduced the stuff I find at work um uh, video uh, what, uh that pretty much came to me um one of my most popular plays that I ever wrote was about working in retail like I said I've been working in retail for over 20 years uh so I just decided hey you know like let, let's just have a weekly you know, segment where I view crap I find work, and that one actually did pretty good. Like, you know, we, we got uh, significant, like, you know, like, views throughout, you know, so I stuck to that, like, you know, one episode a week, one episode a week. Uh, 
but then I kind of got burnt out on that one, like just trying to maintain it. So then I cut it down to whenever I found items. But even then, people were still really enjoying it. But my main passion behind the channel was always wrestling. Um, so fast forward to now. Um, so three years in, um, at 149 subscribers, which is great. Don't get me wrong. Like, you know, thank you guys so much, uh, you know, like for sticking with me during this time. But I, I guess just what I'm trying to say, like, cause, you know, you guys know I got ten, have a tendency to ramble on. Um, just just my, my passion really isn't there anymore in, re in regards to making the videos. Um, you know, it's just it's the fact that I've tried so hard to put effort into this and to put it like as my main forefront like you said you know I've dedicated time to like sit to a schedule put out weekly videos promote the living crap out of it I've invested money like you know I boosted videos uh with with money I signed up for the TubeBuddy app uh you know like just all these things to get people to watch and to get my name out there and I just and, I, and, and it's just it's just not there and you know like i i know that everyone says like you know like you're you know you're still a small youtuber you know it takes time but like you know it just feels like you know like i'm three years in now and i feel like that i haven't achieved anything at all i got you know i see other people who are just starting out like they've been doing it for like two months and they're already at like three thousand four thousand subscriptions and and i look at their videos and they're good you know but it's just like you know it's it it's it's really it's really disheartening like you know like that i've put like a lot of effort into the videos and it's funny like you know i'll post a video i'll post a link and i'll get like like you know all these people liking the link like like 50 likes but yet there's only two views on the video and it's just like oh, okay that, that's great you guys like the link i posted but but you didn't watch the video and, it, and like you know I'm, I'm not doing it for the views uh but like i said like like as an actor um like, you know, like, like, feedback is always the most positive thing. And if you guys see my videos, I always sign off with, like, like, hey, what did you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. And, you know, there's very little comments. Like, you know, I, I do have a lot of fans out there that have been consistent. Like, like you, you guys know who you are. Uh, you never miss an episode. You're always in the chat room. We're always interacting. Uh, it's just, just, just right now, just, just my heart's not in it anymore. Uh, for a little bit, um, it, and it's it's been like that for a little while. You guys have probably seen that, like, the past couple weeks, just the quality just kind of like tapered off because I'm just like, you know, why am I gonna put any effort into it if if people aren't even gonna care about it? So, um, so, um, I'm I'm gonna be taking a break from YouTube. I guess is what I'm just trying to say. Um, it, it's not that I'm giving up. I, I I just I just need I just need a break to refocus. And figure out why I want to do this. Um, like I said, I originally did it just to remain creative and just to be happy. But now I'm just like, it's, you know, it, it's that old saying like, don't do something if you're not enjoying doing it. Like you know, like don't have a hobby if you're not enjoying doing it. And and right now the YouTube thing, I'm not enjoying doing it. Uh, never thought I'd say that. Uh, you know, I used to love doing it. Like you know, I invested all this gear I got lights and a microphone and a soundboard and all this stuff just to make the videos better and and unfortunately it's just yeah um but yeah like i said you know i'm not going away forever like you know i'm just taking a couple weeks off just to refocus and get my head back in the game um i'm still gonna be on twitter i'll still post stuff on the facebook page uh but but as for videos um if something cool happens or if i'm inspired i'll put a video up but uh, as of right now i won't be doing uh, the weekly live stream. I won't be doing the NXT reviews. Um, it, it's just right right now. I, I I just need to get back to why I fell in love with wrestling, and, and just just watch it for what it is, and not be so overly critical. Like you know, there's like you know, I was also finding like I'm watching it to find stuff that's wrong with it, so I could discuss about it, and I find that I'd be missing the matches completely, and it, it just wasn't worth it in the end. So, uh, so once again, thank you guys out there to everybody who stuck by me during this crazy YouTube venture. Uh, I love you guys all from the bottom of my heart. Uh, I never thought that I would even reach like 150 subscribers, so that, that's absolutely great. Uh, but yeah, so like I said, I'm gonna be gone for a couple weeks. I'll keep you guys posted in regards to how things are going with me. Don't worry, I'm still happy, I'm still great, I'm healthy, uh, had a physical, I'm doing good, family's doing good, work's doing good. It's, it's just, 
I, I just need time to, to reinvigorate my creative juices, if that makes any sense. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. This isn't goodbye, this is just ta-ta for now. Uh, so until next time, uh, this is JP from Kayfabe Chronicles, and I'll see you guys hopefully soon.